right, 4HSFootball.com here with head coach Damian Jones of the Shamanada Madonna Lions. Saying it's so fast, it ain't funny because your offense was fast tonight. Your team was fast tonight. Your team just won the Class 1 in state championship here in 2022. Coach, perfect season, undefeated throughout the whole season. What is it about your team that was so special tonight? And what makes you get you thing to say, hey, y'all are the top team in the state? What did it make you get you? Because y'all played lights out tonight. These kids work their tail off. They work their tail off all year. These coaches work their tail off, man. So I'm just proud of them, man. We deserve this. We deserve this. We put in the time and effort to I mean, look at this. Right? You got five gold medals sitting here. Represents each state championship you have won as a coach. This is your seventh year here. You've won five, two straight now. I mean, you know, talk about Cedric Bailey, Davian Gods, Jeremiah Smith. I mean, these guys were playing all over the field. I mean, you came out and you only took 66 seconds off the clock to score in the first first drive of the game. I mean, did you expect that for your guys to come out and score that fast? We've been doing it all year. We've been putting up points all year. Uh, we're and they've been doing a great job, man. So it's kind of something we practiced, something we worked on all year. So I wasn't surprised. Uh, just didn't know how the outcome was going to end, but I was happy with it. Now, I got to say this. You're not done with the season just yet. Right. You got one more game left. Right. And that's the that's the that's the the, the, the Geico Bowl Champions game, right. I believe. Right. And you got Bishop Gorman. You're going to go out to Bishop Gorman, I believe. You're going yes. so talk about that. The kids are going to get go on a trip, go go well, play one more game to to maybe put this uh, record a little bit more. You know, keep that you know go out and play a team that is well nationally known in Bishop Gorman. And and, and that's a good thing. We was out there last year. We uh, didn't play Bishop Gorman, but it was a great trip, and we look forward to having the trip again and playing a top opponent that's nationally ranked. So, I mean, what do you tell these guys? your seniors that are going to be uh, heading off here, you know, because I bet you know you got a lot of underclassmen that are going to be still here, so what, what do you tell the seniors for the final time, you know, uh, you know, playing in a state title game, you know, because, I mean, se seven consecutive trips, that's a state record. Yeah, something uh, like that. If it's state record, you know, to, to take the team, you know, seven straight years, so, I mean, what do you tell you guys who have played in all, you know, these guys that, you know, they've played in every state championship game in their, in their know, career? We, we take it one game at a time, um, and I tell my guys, it hasn't hit me yet that, you know, it's a big deal. I don't think it's a big deal, um, but it's a big deal in being blessed to be in a situation like this, so I'm, I'm thankful. So, all right. Get ready for Bishop Gorman next week, and uh, it'll be, uh, it'll, it'll, we'll, see, we'll see if the, uh, you know, uh, add one more win to the, to, regular, to the season total. Let's see. Congratulations, Coach, on winning the Class 1M State Championship over Clearwater Central Catholic. Thank you.